Hi everyone, in this video, let's explore how we can use generative AI features such as text to image and text effects inside of the new Adobe Express beta. Let's go and open our browser and type in new.express.adobe.com using our Adobe ID. As you can see in my screen, I have been successfully logged in, but if you want, you can easily create your own Adobe account so all of your changes will be saved. You can access the text to image and text effects using the following options. You can click on the generative AI category. If I click here, you would see that you can access the text to image function. Type a specific prompt that you want. In our example, we're going to create a birthday invitation card for this activity. Let's click on here. I want to create a cake as a background image. So let's type in white birthday cake in a table. Let's click on generate. And as you would see, it will automatically create a specific image based from your prompt. So, okay, so I've created something like this. If I want, I can easily change the prompt by adding a much more descriptive prompt. For example, let's remove the white and then let's make it as a colorful birthday cake in a table with gifts. Let's try that. Let's click on generate and you would see that we have lots and lots of options where we're going to create the content type. By default, it's set to none, but you can easily create variations by clicking the content type and you have four options. If you want, you can create a photorealistic rendering. If I click on that, this will automatically create a new set of images that you want to pick on. For example, you can also easily choose a style that you would need. For example, if I want, I can easily like go to themes and let's create a photo product in that category, make it hyper-realistic, and click on Generate. Take note that after generating the image, you can easily change your mind by clicking on the text to image. And this will enable you to create more variations as you would prefer. In my example, I'm just going to click here. The next one is I'm going to show you how to use text effects inside of Adobe Express. Let's click on the text option here on the left side of the screen. Let's click on that. And it will give you on the bottom, let's click on text effects. This is how you could access this feature. Let's click on text effects. I can choose from a preset inside of the text effects and click on this. Automatically, it will give you some variations of the design that you're trying to create. In my case, I'm just going to double click this and type in the message that I want. Let's say, happy birthday. I can easily change a lot of the settings inside of this. If you want, you can make the change the prompt. Let's type in white and hit on generate. And automatically, it will create a new version or new X effects for that type of prompt. You can also modify the results by clicking on the following. Let's click on the second option. So that's how easy it is for you to implement text effects inside of Adobe Express. And there are a lot of samples that you can easily use. And let's click on view all. You would see there are a lot of possibilities. So that's it. I hope you find value in this video. Let's express ourselves and get creative with Adobe Express.